The agency that helped feed many Hernando County seniors is no longer operating, so Feeding Tampa Bay had to come up with a new plan. ABC Action News reporter Eric Waxler went along as they found a way to deliver to those in need. This is not normally how Feeding Tampa Bay delivers food in Spring Hill. I couldn't be more thankful, and they're very sweet and caring. The agency that handled giving out food to low-income seniors in Spring Hill suddenly shut down. So Scarlett Haynes with Feeding Tampa Bay had to come up with an alternate plan and fast. She rented a truck, found a co-worker to drive, and today they hand-delivered nearly 40 meals. Food items. So we've got two different kinds of um, pasta. We've got cereal, milk, juice, all kinds of good canned vegetables Fantastic. and meat. If you look at the grand scheme of things, um, we're making magic happen every day, and it's, it's really amazing. During these difficult times, Feeding Tampa Bay says they are getting more requests for help than normal. Seniors are especially vulnerable right now. They're all, you know, struggling in all of their own ways, um, in ways that I can't imagine. Patty says she couldn't ask for more than this door-to-door -door service. Well, I'm sure everybody appreciates it. They are homebound, so just the fact that we can come bring it to their doorstep is, you know, amazing for them. In the future, seniors who can drive will pick up food at a central location, but for those here that can't, home delivery will still be available. In Spring Hill, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.